no need to argue. Parents just don't understand. <laughs> school shopping. It was me, my brother, my mom, oh my pop, and my little sister all hopped in the car. We headed downtown to the gallery mall. My mom started bugging with the clothes that she chose. I didn't say them, but first I just turned up my nose. She said, what's wrong? The shirt cost $20. I said, mom, the shirt is plaid with a butterfly collar. And then I was a single thing. She wanted to buy me clothes from 1963. And then she lost her mind and did the ultimate. She bought me zips. I said, Mom, what are you doing? You ruined my rent. She said, you're only 16. You don't have a rent yet. I said, Mom, let's put these clothes back, please. She said, no. You go to school to learn how for a fashion show. I said, if the zip isn't shining, I'm gone. I'm not thousand. Let's go back to Bell Bob and Brady Bunch trousers. But if you don't want to, I can live with that. But you got to put back the double and reversible slacks. She wasn't with it. Everything stayed the same. Inevitably, the first day of school came. I thought it could get over. I tried to play six, but my mom said, no, no way. Uh-uh. Forget it. There was nothing I could do. I tried to relax. Got dressed up in those ancient artifacts. When I walked into school, it was just as I thought. The kids were packing up, laughing at the clothes that mom bought. And those who weren't laughing still had a ball, because they were pointing and whistling as I was walking down the hall. I got home, told my mom how my day went. She said, if they're laughing at you, don't need them, because they're not good friends. With a big I was trying to explain to my mom I was going to have to do this about 200 more times. So tell you other kids all across the land, no need to argue, parents just don't understand. <laughs> okay, here's the situation. My parents went away for a week's vacation and they left the keys to the brand new porch. Parents just don't understand. <laughs>